Well, let's face it, if you live here in the Valley, which you obviously do because you're watching us right now, golf is a huge thing. And you have so many family and friends that come out here and just want to go golfing with you on our beautiful golf courses. Well, if you're going to be doing that, you might want to sort of have an upper hand since you live here and you're probably on the courses all the time. Joining me now is a golf fitness instructor. This is Andrew. It is Andrew Fodge. That's right. And he is going to show us some exercises that will sort of help you I don't know, beat the game? Yeah, the, get better. I don't know the, the lingo words that, <laughs> that you guys use, but you're going to make us better. Absolutely. Um, and so what I did is I brought two of my colleagues here, Tyler okay. and Chris from Expert Golf AZ Instruction. And I just want to show like a simple setup posture and just kind of identify some things that are very common with guys specifically. Uh, guys, go and get into like a setup posture for me. It's a normal setup posture. And so with Chris, you can kind of see how his spine kind of curves forward a little bit. So we're going to try to fix that today, like in a few minutes that we have, and we'll see a difference pretty quick. And Tyler, he has better posture here, but you can see how straight his legs are. And so we're going to try to fix that real quick as well. Okay? Now, is this just the way that they're built? That they're built yeah. or just that they've gotten into the habit of it could doing be, that? It could be one or the other. It could be anything. Okay. They're both scratch golfers. What's that mean? They're both great golfers. Okay, I'm obviously I don't golf, right? And I bet there's people out there that don't right. know what that is. They, they, Scratch is good. They make par, you know, pretty much all the time. You did it again. Or better. What Here does that go. mean? So, but what it is, is like, I mean, these guys are really good, okay. but we can always improve and make it better. All right, and well, so, let's help them improve. So here we go. So I'm going to start Tyler here on what I call a forward fold. And what we're going to do is prop his toes up first on this little foam roller I have. And we're going to put this towel right between the knees. Now, what we're going to do is have him reach up for the ceiling or the sky and fold over and try to touch those toes. Now, because his legs were really straight, right? right? And we want them and to I, be... I know he can't touch his toes to save his life already. You okay. can see how Don't close he is right now. Don't make him do it, poor guy. So we're going to do about 10 of these. I'm going to leave him alone while I fix Chris here. Okay. But we're going to do 10 with the toes up, and then we're going to do 10 more with the heels up. Now, by squeezing the towel and we're activating these muscles on the inside of the thighs, uh -huh. we're turning off the tightness here. Okay. So it's allowing him more range of motion. Now, if he has better setup posture when he's ready to play, he has the more ability to get more club head speed. This is what we're really trying to shoot for is club head speed means more distance. Okay. Okay. Thank you for so doing I'm gonna, that. <laughs> I'm going to leave him alone okay. while we fix Chris here. You're going to be fixed, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So we're going to put, uh, we're going to what's called a waiter's bow and a simpler name is probably like a deadlift. Okay. His golf club is going to be against his tailbone between the Mm -hmm. And I'm going to have him basically bow like he's in a nice restaurant and he's serving, you know, me potentially. <laughs> uh, just go into a bow until he feels a really good stretch down in the hamstrings. Now you can see he's maintaining contact here. That means his spine is neutral and that's what we want. So he's going to keep going. So do a few more. How often is, is he going to do this? He could do this every day. Okay. Uh, but ideally, like, you know, three times a week with his normal workout routine um, just to improve what he's doing. Now, you can see how he's starting to loosen up a little bit, and he's keeping this great posture here. Okay? How does that feel? Really good. So, basically, okay. we're trying to sort of train... Tr we're training his legs right. to sort of get him to bend a little more. And, and we're, we're training, training his back. And we're trying to keep him a little straighter. Okay. So, let me show you something. Uh, Tyler, go ahead and step off and try touching your toes. And let's see how close he gets. Oh, it's like magic. Oh, oh so you touch your toes. Can you touch your toes? I can touch my toes okay. and the ground. Stephanie, can you touch your toes? <laughs> oh, no. cheater. <laughs> well, we are going to have uh, all of the information on our website. Obviously, this is just a couple of exercises. Um, you guys are located where, or do you travel all over? Uh, in Scottsdale, we have two locations, and these guys also teach at two locations as well. Uh, we have an event this Saturday from 10 to 2 at Silverado Golf Club. Okay. Uh, you can call me or go to my website, and I will definitely give you the information. Great. So right. go to our website, SonoranLiving.com, and we'll give you all of his information. All right. Um, Stephanie's looking for some free golf tips, and we will see you guys back here tomorrow. Have a great day. <laughs>